Hey everyone, this is Andy here. Um, today I want to talk to you about my first version of uh, my app, Secured Notes. Um, pretty much, it's gonna be like a video series of mine that I'm just gonna really like document through um, creating this app. Um, so this is I'm already on version two currently. I just start filming this, but um, I just want to start off with the kind of backstory and then how I'm gonna get into version two. Um, so I already started version two. There's pretty much like whatever you're gonna see now. It's that. So the reason why this project name started off being uh, going to Japan um, was because um, I was going to Japan and I wanted to create an app. This is like the master version. This is like version one. Is where I'm at right now, and um, this is kind of like a sample I have of how it works. Essentially. Um, when you use the app, you have like a list and um, essentially it's read only. So um, if it's the day of or after the day of, it will show a date and the date will be visible. The cell is visible. You click on it, enter a password if it's not the day of yet. So if it wasn't the day yet, I think this was like filmed on the 11th or something like that of September. So the bottom last cell, you can't see it yet because of the fact that you. It's not a day off yet, so sorry, it was the 14th, so it was probably like the 15th was a day over there or something like that. So you can't open it, you can't even enter a password until that day of. So I kind of had some security measures, just really a password, and a measure that I don't want her to be able to read any of these letters until the day of. So essentially, um, when you have it, you can type in a password. If it's not, it's pretty, really, really simple security measurement, it's just, you know, a random password. So the point that I just showed here um, in this video, um, so in the bottom is the two tab bar view controllers. One of them is called a password a tab bar view controller. Essentially with this one, you're getting the passwords. So um, obviously not the most secure, but pretty much is a read-only app just for her anyways. So the password's hidden. She would have to tap on it to get, it, to get a copy of it. And that's the only way you can actually access it. So she also gets a notification actually the day of when these um, nodes are quote unquote unlocked. So essentially you go do that and you paste the password after you go through the password tab of your every controller. And as long as you've entered this password before, you don't have to enter it again. Um, the only reason why you would have to is if this app crashes and or if you kill the app in the background, it is the only time where you had to re-enter the password just so that no one else would be able to get in. So now that we get got over this part, um, I'm just gonna quickly go over to my current repo. I'm going to get checked out to master real quick. Thanks for watching. This is the end of the video. Uh, please like and subscribe to this video if you enjoyed this kind of video and subscribe to see more videos like this. I'm going to make this into more of an interactive series where you guys get to actually tell me more about what you want in this app. Currently, this is just the first version. I do intend on making a second version, which leads me on to the second episode of this series where I will talk about this. So please stay tuned and subscribe. Thank you.